Adobe InDesign has some great features for linking various forms of text on the file system, and Silicon Publishing has extended that core functionality to allow you to access assets, including text content, in the cloud. With Silicon Connector, InDesign, and Box, you can link to plain text, InDesign tag text, ICML, Word, and Excel. Let's look at each of these. Plain text linking is a bit disappointing, but it's useful for learning a key preference you'll need later for the more powerful formats. To link to any kind of text, you need to choose Preferences File Handling from the InDesign menu and check Create Links when placing text in spreadsheet files. If you do this when there's no file open, it will remain as the default preference for all new documents. Now you can drag text into documents from Silicon Connector. Let's see the basic concept of linking with plain text. This is a text file in my Box account, and it's showing up as a URL-based link in the Links panel. But the formatting is just default. Let's try formatting it. Now it's beautiful. I would expect that if I edit in box, it will keep the formatting. Let's see, I'll change the text. Before box can even preview the change, InDesign is already aware of it and tells me that the content has been edited. I just double click and the new text will appear. However, just as it warned me, text comes in each time fresh and unformatted. It turns out that you need something beyond plain text to seriously link to content from InDesign. Fortunately, there are a number of great options. InDesign Tag Text is one of the most powerful features of the InDesign product. Because I set the preference earlier, when I drag an InDesign Tag Text file into InDesign, I get a link to beautiful text that is well formatted. When I edit in box, I can change the text and leave the formatting markup. This time it will update and keep the formatting. However, you have to be something of a computer scientist to hand tag raw tag text. Tag text does have value in automated workflows. For example, you can automate conversion of HTML from WordPress into tag text, send that to Box, and use the linked content in your InDesign document. InCopy presents a more out-of-the-box workflow. With ICML, the InCopy markup format, multiple articles in a single InDesign document can be edited concurrently by different authors all around the world. Here's an ICML file linked to from InDesign and anyone with access to the same Box account can edit this article. InCopy provides a simple interface that lets them focus on content rather than formatting, although the authors do have full access to rich text formats. Working with Box and ICML is not the same as a pure InCopy workflow, yet it works quite well. Microsoft Word is a very similar workflow. I can edit directly in Word, save it, and the formatting is retained. If you do this properly, you will map Word styles to InDesign styles. The danger with Word is that authors may not respect styles, so either you need some well-trained authors or some automation to make it work smoothly. Microsoft Excel is yet another form of text editing, and linking to Excel files can let those who really live and breathe spreadsheets focus on the numbers, while the InDesign designer makes the formatting perfect. I'm going to edit this Excel file from Box and save it back to Box. As with all connector links, I see the indication that the Excel file is updated, so I just double-click and the content is updated while preserving the formatting. Just like with Word, some work is required to make an Excel workflow happen. I set the column widths of this table and formatted it with table styles and cell styles. Yet with relatively little effort, it just works. For more information about Silicon Connector for Box, go to siliconpublishing.com box.